Hi guys, just wanted to come on. I've been kind of MIA and I wanted just to do a quick video with you guys to give you a recap and my ladies who are receiving the products just wanted to go through a quick tutorial so I can show you guys how I do it. Um, you can pick up any tips and tricks that I use or go ahead and find your own way. We all do. Everybody gets their, their own little habits and it gets nice and um, easy once you start playing with it, you start figuring out your own way that you like to do it. So today I'm basically gonna be using my best friend, uh, my best uh, blend forever brush. This is gonna give me more of a light coverage. That's what I'm looking for today. I'm gonna be going in in a different um, pattern. You know how usually I start with my contour. This time, since I want something super simple, I'm going in with my main color, which is, I'm using Goddess. Maybe I should do half of my face only so I can show you the difference. So this brush, the bristles are way softer and more fluffy. It starts picking up a lot less product when I dip it into my tin and when I'm fluffing it on my face, it's giving me a super light layer. Basically what this does for me is just evens me out because I have a couple of, you know, different pigments on my face, different colorations. This is just gonna give me that nice evened toned that we all want. my nose all right so you can see how quickly I just put that on right you can already see the difference um, I have some redness now this side's kind of looking a little bit more um, red you know you see the little different colors here you can already tell the difference on my face Okay, so then that is that with that color. I'm gonna be going in with my brightening color, my next shade that's a little lighter. This is really like my concealer color. Just dabbing that in my, um, down the side of my nose, kind of below my eyes, on my eyelids. This is just to brighten me up a little bit, give me some nice, um, coverage below my eyes so I can get rid of you know those white spots I mean those dark circles putting some over here above my eyebrows to give me that highlight in that area that I want it brightening me up a little bit down here I'm just gonna carry this up like that All right, so there goes my other color. You guys can already see, can you tell? All right, it's a big difference. You can't really tell, look how red. Okay, so I'm gonna go in and dip with my contour color. This is my darkest color that I'm gonna be using. I'm going over a little bit higher than I normally do. Kind of been using a different technique lately. Instead of the hollow of my cheek, I'm kind of going over the bottom, the right over my, my cheekbone. Okay, and up to like my temple area. You can see how dark this color is, but look, it's not dark on my face. It blends in so nicely. And this also works as coverage for me. Okay, I'm putting also some contour right here the top near my hairline coming down like to the corner of my eyebrows a little bit okay. and I'm going to use the smaller side just to contour the side of my nose a little bit super simple look today this is like my mom everyday look, right? Just dipping a little bit of contour above my lip line to give me a little bit of that shadow. Okay. 
And again, I'm gonna be blending all this in. And I'm just gonna add a little bit more contour. You can tip, you can add as little as much as you want. Okay. Actually, I'm only gonna do half of my face today just to give you guys a good um picture. So that's it, you guys. I just contoured, I just did my makeup on one side. Just gonna go in a little bit with that brightening highlight color and let me just blend that in a little bit beautiful gonna go in and just do my eyebrow on that one side i'm using my hotline brush This is an eyeshadow named um, Trust, which I've been using to fill in my eyebrows. We have different shades that anybody can use depending on your colors, but I love using a shadow to do my brows. Okay, you guys, can you tell the difference on my face, right? So going back in, just gonna do half of my lips, dabbing into that contour color again. All our colors can be used for many reasons. Just lining a little bit. And just gonna fill in that color. This is sandstone, one of my favorite colors. Okay, don't I want you guys to see. What do you guys think? Do you see it? Because I see it. Let me just take a quick picture. To use as my before and after. So there you go, you guys. I basically just did my makeup on one side and I can totally see the difference. There's a couple of little extras that I like to do sometimes that I'm just gonna show you. This is just kind of a little extra extra that I like. I take that brightening color and just put a little bit more you can use your blending uh, perfector sponge. I forgot to wet mine, but I'm just gonna use it super quick just to show you. Or you can just dab it in with your finger. Okay, like that. This just gives me like that extra little boost, extra like wake me up, refreshed feel. And that is it, you guys. I just did half of my face. Um, I love it. You can't, I mean, honestly, I can just completely touch my face. I'm not worried about anything coming off. Obviously, if you're going to wipe your face off with a napkin or a blanket, obviously. But my face feels completely, completely thin, layered, almost like if I have nothing on my face, you guys. I'm telling you, this is a amazing and it's buildable. So let's just say this was my day look. I wanted to get ready, go out tonight. I'm just gonna dip into my contour. 
I'm using a different brush because remember the other brush that I used was very light coverage but now I want a little bit more of a uh, more of a dramatic look right okay and then I'm gonna use the um the lip and cheek that I used just to put that over that area. Let's pretend this is nice and wet and damp. All right, you guys, so you can tell that it's completely buildable to what you want. Okay. Very easy to apply, super quick, what you want depends on you on how much you put if you want a little bit more blush put on a little bit more blush and blend it out and that's it you guys i'm done so let me know what you guys think but anything that you have any questions on on this video any products that i use just feel free to message me um and I can go ahead and get you color matched. All I need from you is a picture of natural light, no makeup, no filters, and I can get you color matched within minutes just to help you start picking your colors. I'm telling you, you will be amazed. Your full face in one place, customized to you. Nothing gets easier than that. So thank you guys. I'm gonna go finish the rest of my face a little later and I will see you tomorrow.